Hiya, this is a, a video really about if you're interested in starting your own business. Um, we've been very keen to do that, um, get our own thing going. We've had enough of working for other people uh, and we decided to take a look into it. Um, what we did was uh, we, we like buying and selling so we've decided to look down the market route of selling at markets. Um, what we did do was to get our stock, we went to the Birmingham NEC uh, where you can get in for free if you book early enough, you don't have to pay and you can buy plenty of stock there from absolutely anything to anything what you're interested in. Um, the type of things we're interested in, always been interested in, is pop memorabilia for me. Um, I like anything to do with music business. Um, obviously not records and CDs well catered for, but what I was looking for was something a little bit different. Um, so I found uh, an outlet up there that would provide me with, the, with what I wanted. So um, I can show you now what we decided to go for, for our stall. Um, and this is, I've laid it all out really as a stall would be. Um, and now we have had it. Um, we, we also take this little table along um, over here because if we want some extra space, we can, we can stick stuff out like that. And um, you know, sort of brings the stall around a little bit more and sometimes there's always a little gap so you can fill it in so that's what we tend to do um, also if you look at our stall uh, a lot of times we'll have a little, little shelf along the back and we'll put stuff up on that as well to give it a bit of height height also makes it better but I haven't done that for this particular thing just to show you what we've actually got okay for the more modern stuff we've got One Direction you know, Kings of Leon mugs, nice, nice quality, and uh, one thing I say, they they are fully licensed, so there's no comeback. Don't buy unlicensed gear in pop memorabilia because you're really not allowed to sell it. Um, but this stuff, you pay a little bit more, but it's high quality, and I say the license is critical. You can't sell without a license, so you must have that. The mugs are really nice. I mean, we've gone to classic Beatles mugs. Um, and there's another classic Beatles one there uh, because a lot of people know Beatles. Uh, we've got more modern, you say Coldplay uh, mugs, they're very nice. Um, to, to Elvis Presley. Um, also, we tried to tie things up a little bit, like if we've, we've got the Who mug here, um, and we'll also have the, the Who magnet, so they're a fridge magnet. Uh, and they sort of obviously go well together, so we've, we've stuck with that as well. As we have done with a Pink Floyd, um, again we've got a Pink Floyd mug, it's obviously Dark Side of the Moon uh, emblem there, and we've, we've gone the same with our, our Pink Floyd magnet. So that's something we just decided to do that to sort of tie things up, because sometimes people, will, if they're really into a band, they'll buy everything there is. Uh, if they've got a Pink Floyd mug, they'll have the, they'll have the magnet as well. Um, it's simply because they like that type of thing. Um, I mean, the little small stuff is nice and easy to carry. The mugs are the hardest car around, but things like a Leonard Skinner patch, you know, there's no weight, so it's nice and easy to get them to where you want to go to sell these things. You know, uh, even, you know, a lot of heavy metal band merch, uh, Iron Maiden, these aren't too heavy to cart around. Um, so we've got quite a nice extra stuff, and even the Beatles, um, little port holes there. Um, I mean, they're fantastic from Yellow Submarine, obviously, and, you know, fantastic stuff. We really liked it. So we've bought ourselves a good selection. Um, so get everything you can. I mean, we've even got One Direction there. We've, we think they're still together, so it's good. <laughs> That's the only thing you may have to worry about is if they disband, of course, if you go too modern, uh, then you're stuck with them. But we, we took a chance, we haven't got many. Um, and we've got things like a, a One Direction purse, you know, for the youngsters. A lot of the kiddies prefer something, you know, that is modern and they'd buy something like that because it's in the charts. Again, I say, it's up to you what you decide to buy. This is our particular field that we like. Uh, now, one other thing to think, if you're doing a market stall, uh, one thing to remember, you will need a trader's licence. Um, they are about 80 to £90, pound, so it is a bit of a kill at first to get you started, but after that you're covered. Okay, the market stall generally is between 10 and £20 pound a stall, so bear in mind you've got to clear that and your petrol cost before you start making profit. So they're all costs to add in. Uh, we bought this table, um, which was another £30, £40. Pound. Um, 
Don't forget, presentation, we've got this cloth to, to lay on the front of ours. Makes it look a lot nicer. Don't just have a bare old table that all thumb on it. Just won't look presentable. So have it, have it looking nice. And, and we've sold all right so far. And we're going to carry on going. Um, now one other thing that I will talk about, just before we go, a very important one really, is it, obviously this is our outlet with the markets. But also the other outlet, one that you should seriously think about, is uh, the internet of course, which is why you're looking at this. Um, we've also made an internet site, website, with all this stuff. Every item is on our site, and it's all listed there. So if you are interested in any of these things, by the way, you can always go there and have a look, and if you want to buy anything on there, you can actually buy it from our site, which is also your other revenue avenue, really, to go up. And, and if you've got a website there, um, obviously I can hand out cards for people at the store with our website address on. So if they don't buy anything on the day, at least they may think, oh, I, you know, they're not going to be there next, you know, because we only did a particular market. If they've got your card with your web address on there, they can at least go to your website and buy whatever it was they're interested in. Because uh, all the things are on there that are on this store and you can go there, buy anything you want. There's all buy it now, so you can buy it straight off. Um, all using PayPal of course. Um, so that's the other good avenue to go down. So I will now stick my hand above my head like this and say the website address is going to be right there above my head. So if you are interested in any of our stuff, there's our address right there. I can see it. Yeah, looks good to me. So please do go and check it out just to see you know what you can do. So by all means, if you've had enough of working for somebody, you want to take a gamble and take the plunge, do what we've done take a chance, go in there and do your stuff, get the site up you want, do your gear and enjoy, because that's what life about, enjoying yourself. Okay, thanks for watching, bye bye.